everybody and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be doing a juice review and I was sent um, four sample sizes from Steam Juice to try out and uh, see what they're all about. They did send them to me for the purpose of this review but that will not be changing my opinion on the flavors of the um, e-liquids. My opinions of course. Every now flavor is of course subjective to everybody and everybody has different flavor profiles So what I might like you might not like and what you might not what you might like I might not like so Let's go ahead and get started. I did of course as I always did got four setups freshly wicked I'm ready to go um, So that we can go ahead and do them and not have any mixing of liquids so that we can do a more accurate description of the flavors um Again, I did get it in this box. When you open up the box, oops, it comes with a couple stickers. This is like one of their sample packs. And it's got a couple stickers, and then of course their card, and then I've got my four little juices right here, which I have not even opened. They're still in the plastic. So we'll go ahead and open those. And let's get started here. So I did look up the flavor profiles to see what they're about, just so that I can give you that information as I'm tasting them. Um, so that it gives a little bit more of an accurate description. So Let's go ahead and get started. So what I have today is blonde ginger Let's make sure that you can see that blonde ginger and then we've got very Greek fruity to try Don't think they're being uh, a little bit out of focus and we've got knee high. And finally, we've got Perinella. Let's see about that one. Perinella. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and have one for each setup, of course. And on the first setup, we'll go ahead and try I looked them up, so I'm really excited to try <laughs> them. Um, let's go ahead and try the blonde ginger. And the blonde ginger is a French vanilla with velvety custards with fresh bananas and summer strawberries. So I'm really, really excited because that sounded delicious, I have to say. Yes, I cheated. I did it the old way. The whole thing. Yeah. So let's go ahead and Drip that on there. I'm trying to see what I smell. I smell like banana. I definitely smell the banana. So let's go ahead and get that on there. Yummy. I'm excited. Of course, I'm going to make a big old mess trying to do it in camera for you. Don't worry because I did come prepared. So let's go ahead and try this out. So again, this is blonde ginger. And I came prepared. <laughs> go ahead and wipe up that excess that I like to do. And we'll go ahead and put the top cap on. And yes, it's in my blue apocalypse. So we'll go ahead and turn that up because I was just dry firing before. And let's have a bait. Yes. I definitely, definitely taste the bananas, and they are fresh bananas. It's not like a candy banana. I don't taste too much of the strawberries, though. I taste more banana and like a vanilla custard, but it's there. It's afterwards. <laughs> Very good flavor, very. I'm glad that this was my first one. Yeah, this is very good. So this was the blonde ginger, so we'll go ahead and put that aside. And next we'll go ahead and bake the, let's 
try the very Greek fruity. So we'll try that one next. And again, freshly wicked. Let's go ahead and do that one. And that one is very Greek fruity. And that one is a Greek yogurt with your choice of free of three flavors add-in options. Now, um, they didn't ask me what I wanted added in, so it might just be a plain yogurt, but I do like yogurt vapes, so that's fine with me, and especially Greek yogurts have more of a tang to it, so they're yummy. They are yummy. Let's go ahead and get that nice and wicked, and then I'll tell you. Yeah, I think this one's just a plain yogurt, though, but we'll find out. It smells good, though. It smells just like Greek yogurt that you get in the store. So let's go ahead and put that one on and turn it up. And yes, it's on my apocalypse, the heat treated. And turn that up, get her hot, and take a vape. It's a very, very good and smooth Greek yogurt flavor. But I can't tell if there is fruit in there. I really don't know what it is. I know that they have an option. I think of raspberry, blueberry, and another one. It's either strawberry or cherry, I think. Um, but it didn't really say on the flavor profile when I looked it up. Very, I, this could be an all day bait for me. It definitely can. Yeah, my nose is running from blowing it out my nose to, flame, to taste it. <laughs> definitely very good. Yeah, I like that one. Even without any additional fruits, it's good. So the next one I'm going to try will be the knee high. And this one, the flavor profile of this one is watermelon and grape candy. Now, if you um, watch any of my juice reviews, you'll be able to tell, by the way, it's freshly wicked. You, you'll be able to tell that I don't, I'm not really into candy vapes. Um, the only ones that I have had that I liked were from um, Adrenaline Vapors. They have a couple candy flavors that I did like. But other than that, I haven't really tasted a candy flavor that I really like. So I'm really looking forward to this one. So let's go ahead and take a vape on this as soon as I get all my wicks all wet. Of course, I need some over here on this side too. Make sure I got it all. Okay, so we're ready for this one. Again, knee high, the watermelon grape flavor. Okay, get that one all heated up. And we're gonna be vaping this one on my peak apocalypse and my adrenaline vapor box. This is the LRS box. And let's take a bait. Turn it up a little bit. I taste the grape predominantly. More grape than watermelon. It's not too sweet. It doesn't have like that candy sugar sweetness to it. I taste very little watermelon, but more grape, but like candy grape flavor. So 
It's another good one. Um, I'm just not into candy flavors. But it's definitely a good one. Another good one. Do another four. And the last one. Since I only have three Apocalypse, this is actually going to be on my Freak Show V2. And we're going to be doing the last one, which is Pear Nella. So let's go ahead and try that one. Now this one, the flavor profile, is Pear with... I'm really excited about this one too, by the way. Pear with Bavarian cream and a pinch of vanilla. Mm. Yeah, I love Bavarian cream, so... You can smell the pear. Let's get that in there. It smells good. Let's see what we taste. That all in there. This one takes a little bit more wicking because it's like a bigger juice channel and I don't want to get it in the airflow if at all possible to make a bigger mess that I usually make so I'm really really excited Paranella and it's actually listed as Brittany's Paranella on the website let's turn that up Okay, so let's do this. Okay, so Paranella. Close down the airflow a little bit. This one's got a lot of airflow. I taste the pear. And the Bavarian cream is right on the exhale. And it's like a vanilla flavor with the Bavarian cream. So it's good. This could also be an all day vape. Very smooth, very creamy, very good dessert. So yeah, these this is good. So We've got the Very Greek Fruity, which is a Greek yogurt, and you can pick your type of fruit that you want in it. We've got the Blonde Ginger, which is the um, vanilla custard with um, bananas and strawberries. And then we've got the Knee High, which is the watermelon and grape candy. And then we've got the Pear Nilla, which is the pear with Bavarian cream and a pinch of vanilla. So if I was to list them, in order of preference, I would have to say that my preference would be the blonde ginger. I really like that banana flavor in it. So yes, this is a definite yes for me. And then the Greek yogurt. I'm partial to Greek yogurt. So this one, again, all subjective to my flavor profile. And then I'd have to say the Paranella. I, I really like the Bavarian cream and the pear. I haven't really had a good pear, so this is good. And then we've got the knee high, which is the watermelon grape candy. That would be my fourth choice. Only because I'm not partial to like candy vapes. That's why that's my last. But I mean, for the line that they sent me, I think that it's a really good line. It's it's very, very nice. Um, I what, I think they're, they're, let's see what if they say it on here. I don't know what the VGPG is. I know that they have 50-50 and some others. Mine are, of course, in 3 Nick. Um, these don't say what um, VGPG ratio that they sent me, but I'll leave in the description the, um, the uh, options that they do have, as well as some of those prices. Um, again, they do have sample packs, um, as well as individual um, juice e-juice um, selections. And 
As a matter of fact, they did offer me a coupon code for you guys. So if you go onto their website, which is steamjuice.us, you can enter in the coupon code is vapefam, and I'll leave that also in the link in the description below, along with their the link to their website. And you can actually get 20% off of anything on their website. So I think that that's an amazing, amazing offer. Um, that they gave me for you and I um, really appreciate them sending it to me. Thank you steam juice So yeah, it's a really good line and I think that you should look them up and I give them a two thumbs up Yep So if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and um, If you're not subscribed, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button Make sure that you put on the notifications because in addition to juice reviews I also do device reviews and build tutorials um, which I should be having an, a build tutorial next weekend. Um, we're getting another um, RTA in. So I look forward to seeing you again next weekend. So have a great day. Thanks for watching. Bye.